Welcome in to your spiritual nourishment. I am your shaman empress, a.k.a. the shaman hummingbird, baby. This is going to be for all signs. These are general. I need to take what it's for you. Simply leave what it's not. You know I need you to make sure that you are oversubscribed to your Aries only placements love tarot you could be cross watching for areas as well if you need help to find out where areas is in your chart cafe astrology will be also linked down below for you guys these are general messages so only take what is for you simply leave what is not oh sun moon rising venus north node third party sun moon rising the star and temperance oh star season earth angel someone here wants to connect with you this is someone here that wants to heal with you but it's going to take time because they have to get things balanced it could be an aqua areas or a sectorius. We are in the new world, the new era, aqua areas. We are in the time of truth. It could be because of some kind of truth. All right, this is also someone here that could be guided right now. Yeah, they're trying to figure out their options on how to reconnect. How do we heal? What can I do to heal this? It's also what I'm seeing. Let me make sure we good. Yep, 113 on the timer. 113, yeah. Because this person wants change. Mm -hmm. Um, You have a new people coming in. All right, or you're manifesting new connections. This person could, like, wonder about that as well. That could be, like, worrisome is the words that your ancestors use. The ancestors use. That's what I heard. All right, because if you guys know anything about ancestors and how they speak, sometimes your ancestors stop by. Okay? All right, that's just always mine. All right. Oh, the ace. Oh, I told you, new person. And the three of wands. For some of you guys, you're about to meet somebody new. Um, this is somebody that you are not talking to or not talking to you. This could be someone here that was very, very cold, nonchalant towards you. Um, that's just what it is. Yep, Knight of Pentacles. Yep, death. Mm. This person is losing, like, their, they feel it. Like, the spiritual connection could be starting to fade off. Like, the intuitive part. Mm-hmm. Maybe they can feel the difference in you when y'all connect and it makes them something like that as well. This is something that's ended. The Queen of Swords and the Death card. They know you about the year. You the star, honey. The hermit. Child, yeah. For some of you guys, this is someone here that ghosted you or, you know, gaslit you. But they feel it. They can feel it. You still used to send healing energy to them even though you guys were separated. Mm-hmm. Yep, I see it, sis. I see it, bro. But you're not doing that anymore. Star seed. Or you could be the earth angel with temperance. You're not doing that no more. Yep, king of wands. You're not doing that no more. You ain't taking no kind of action right now. Cancerian, Leo, Virgo. Yeah, it's like, nah. Yep, strength card. So you're calling back your power. You pull back your power. Somebody here, four of pentacles, they know you're holding back. They're aware of that. Like, you're strongly holding back. Could even be ignoring them. Now it then went to the spiritual thing. And it's like fucking them up or something. What else? Two cards, the four swords, yep, and the knight of swords. Now all they think about, now all they've been reflecting on is how do they quickly move, make a move towards you some kind of way. They want to heal this. Now for some of you guys, you could have been broken up with this person, hold up. For like the last four, like, uh, four years or something. Or this been going on between you guys. This look like a lot of spiritual connection. Someone here also could work with like an entity. Mm -hmm, with, with the hermit. Yeah, honey. Look, the queen of swords, three of swords, and the moon. They're secretly hurt. Or this could have like... They could be trying to fight their inner demons or some shit. With the hermit and its strength.
I feel like this person didn't deal with their inner demons before, but they are now. This is why they gaslit you. This is why they ghosted you anyway. This was some inner healing as well that is was involved with this person. Geminian energy there. Leah. Pisces. Aries. All my earth fingers are here as well. Capricorn on to source in Virgo. Leah. I think I already called Leah. All right, let's get your angel number. Let's go a little deeper and see what is going on. We have four, three, four. I'm sorry, four, four, three, three. I'm also seeing, was it four, three, one, four? Yeah, there's only one three here. Okay. I'm also seeing four, four, one, three, one, three, four, four. All right, let's see what we rock with. Five, five, six on the timer. So, yeah, I told you this person wants change. 4413 is a powerful reminder that when we stay true to ourselves, we, I'm sorry, ourselves, use our creativity and trust our intuition. Anything is possible. That's what this person is doing. This is from a message from someone here that, that goes to you. You are moving on. They feel it. They know by the by the feeling, the intuition part of this connection. You could be sending them away spiritually with the death card showing itself. Like when they come, you ain't, yup, you still real cold. You ain't saying shit. You just like basically, you know, like, why are you here? <laughs> so to speak. So this person is thinking that you it got to be somebody else. And it is because you're about to meet somebody. For some of you guys, this person didn't even hear yet. Now, the king of ones with the hermit card, this is somebody here that is real good with energy. They 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 can they know how to feel. They could know how to read. Some shit like that, honey. Mm-hmm. Now, this is also someone here that could be saving up money they could want to like get in their savings to do something for you this is to pull you back in this would be somebody that is slowly like thinking about this i don't know if this is like giving you money or buying you like a big present now someone here also is like they have been eager. It's not that they're eager to go to sleep at night. It's like they're not saying all day, oh, I can't wait till tonight to go to sleep. But at night, they're eager to feel for you, to see what's changed or what's new. Or to see if this new person is in yet or something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Let's see. But they know it. They feel it. They have regrets. It's like now that this is here, now they're going through regrets. They could have rejected you physically, but you're rejecting them spiritually. Now. Hmm. Okay. Well, I mean, I don't know what they expect you to do, baby. What was the hermit? Damn. Okay, Seven of Pentacles. So, this is somebody here that, yeah, they left you waiting. Hold on, guys. Hold on real quick, guys. All right, guys, my bad. Okay, um, yeah, so they left you waiting. They could have left you on red. They wasn't returning your messages. They just left your ass. Yeah. But it's like, yeah, and that's what they're fucking worried about. Oh, for some of you guys, they did this more than one time. Seven of Pentacles. I mean, they could have felt like too much. They let, they, I mean, this was like, that's why it ended. They just left you, and then they decided to just leave you. Show me something on the King of Wands. The fuck? I mean, yep, Five of Cups, and now that's what they regret. Seven of Wands. Yeah, because now you are rejecting them. You're like, cool, Queen of... They didn't think you would accept that, but you did and walked away. We got Five of Pentacles. 
Well, sis, the four of cups. I told you they have major regrets. Seven of wands. Yeah, the knight of cups, the queen of wands, and the ace of pentacles. Yup, because of this new person. You, they, they know you're going towards somebody new or a new person. And, and, and for some of you guys, you don't even see this person yet. What's the four swords? They said switch decks. I don't know. So we're going to switch decks. We'll see if they let me come back to that one. What's the four swords? Jimin and energy. Why is the four swords here? They think you are being sneaky. Someone here monitors you. This is a monitoring spirit. They could work with monitoring spirits. <laughs> and this is to, oh my gosh, yo. This is crazy. Yup, they're trying to figure out what you're doing. The page of ones and where you are going, who the f you doing it with. Yeah, the five of pentacles because you got to be because they're left out in the cold, honey. That's what the knight of swords. So that's what they're doing fast here. Yep, they've been doing this. And for some of you guys, they are going to find this out in like three months or three weeks because this is when this new person comes. And I do see them having an interaction and energy here. Yeah, the strength card. <gasps> oh my gosh. And they're going to get mad. The king of ones in reverse is going to turn into a mad ass bitch with the queen of ones in reverse. Whether this is a man or a woman, he gets his crazy shit from his mom's side. Yep, eight of ones, that's the moon card. Yeah, the moon also represents the mom. This could be coming out of a specific moon. Um, especially if you have like a Capricorn or Sagittarian placement or moon. Aries, Pisces. Yeah, they're nervous. Nine of Swords and Magician. Yeah, because they're... Okay, so... Someone here could feel like they're like... Someone here is good with energy. They're energetic as... Yeah, the Hermit and High Priestess. They're fucking energetic as... Magic ain't working. Or their energetic manipulation. Yup, the chariot. And here the fuck they come to run. Both of y'all asses over. And all your other options. This person here has a double mind. This is a little mental. Oh, this is, could be your divine masculine. Oh, that's why. Okay, that don't make an excuse, but it makes more sense. Or it's like, yeah. You might not know there's a spiritual component to your divine masculine. They never told you. Nope. Child, this person is works with monetary spirits. This person is very creative. Um, mm, what's the four of pentacles? Mm, what the hell? Hold on, y'all. Wait a minute. Okay. What's this? The king, the king of Wands. This person wants to do something for you, y'all. Yep, because they feel like that is going to, you know, and then tell you the truth about something. Or give an opportunity for you to listen to them speak your truth. Yep, Ten of Pentacles, Four of Swords. And that's what they've been thinking about. They feel like this will heal this. They got something they want to say. Yeah, it could cause an argument. But they feel like it's a good decision to do. Because it will still will put you into working on things with them, the Eight of Pentacles. Because they have, they love you. They got love for you. And they wanted to put you in your Queen of Cups. Yeah, I, yeah, they're going to tell For some of you guys, this is more than one truth. Yeah, tennis store. Someone here might actually tell you, that, look, the truth is, regardless, I do love you. Now, what you going to do? Is you going to walk or you want a relationship? They might try, yep, King of Swords. Damn! They're going to try to give you an ultimatum. Someone here is putting their foot down. Oh, my gosh. I don't know, but I should be. <laughs> we want. To... <laughs> oh. Now, for some of you guys, it could even be your new person going through it, like with your ex. And this person could give you an ultimatum as well. Like, is it going to be me or is it going to be them? <laughs> what the. This person is can feel the energy of somebody else. Period. So, um, oh my gosh, uh, yeah, the two of cups. I'm fucking yes, four of cups. Oh. Mm.
Now, if this is this new person's energy, this is what they're going through. If you know this is not in your, yep, I can't make it up. Three of cups, yep, because they got there's a third party here. Period. Let's let's look at this new person, the Ace of Pentacles. Mm -mm -mm. Hold on, y'all. Shit. Five of Swords, yeah. Four of Wands. And the Knight... Aha! Uh -huh. The Knight of Swords came out three times here. Tennis... Ooh. Autumn fell. I can't take Autumn. Queen of Swords and Ten of Swords. I feel like this is what this new person is going through. And their ex could be doing this. Y'all guys could be having similar experiences with exes here. What's, what, what else about this person? Damn. The Queen of Cups and the Four of Swords. They have feelings for you. Mm-hmm. Yep, the Queen of Yeah, the Queen of Pentacles, they do. They also want to offer you something to joke or they want to take a chance with you. But now, like I said, again, for some of you guys they got they, this is an ex connected to this new person. Oh boy, let's see what else is going on here, child. Mm-hmm. This person, see this person moving on being happy with you. This is a hoe. A foe. That's who the, this is. Damn. Yeah. Damn it. They know this person has been coming over there or coming over your house and they want to put that shit to an end. Mm. Yep, they do. What else is going on? Somebody's got to protect yourself. Hope. Yeah, small child. This is an immature person that still has hope. I told you, change. This has changed. This person changed up with this person because they like you. Yeah, main female. They want to make you a main female, but this person is... This is a karmic that's trying to send you a message that they're this person's main female. You're not. Yeah, they are. Pleasant letter and reunion. They want a reunion with this person. Also, I feel like you and this person is meant to have some kind of connection or hair. Yeah, this is a spiritual connection. Lord, Lord on his journey, that's why this person is... Getting blocked, they're mad at you, fighting you, but it could be, it's really like, dad, God, blocking them. Yeah, and they're like, man, they might, man, they might get sick, honey. Someone here might get, yep, they, they might get sick. Yeah, size of a lover. Oh, this could be like, heartbroken sick, like sick to their stomach, baby. Yeah, because this person's with you. Yep, y'all might move in together or something, attract a lot of money. I'm telling you, the funeral. Mm, I'm going to let that go. This is, looks like karma this person is getting from the person you're connecting to. Somebody here is getting karma from this person that's coming in. But see, the problem is God is sending you as a gift to this person. This person ain't do this person right. Um, Let's see this person's feelings and emotions towards you. Let's check that out real quick. What's this person's feelings and emotions towards you? Some of you guys could have watched that one guy. What's his name? Um, or you was a fan of him. He was supposed to play for Marvels. I think he just got in trouble in the court. He played on Harder They Fall. Mm, I just seen something. Mm, mm, mm. Ain't he dating Megan Good right now? So this could be some of their energy. Didn't she leave like a pastor or something? I don't know. Or some. I don't know, child. Something. This is a little. They're, they're showing me them. Um, what's this? The forbidden fruit in reverse. Time out. Yeah. Someone's time is out. Yup. And they're drinking in pain. And boom. Because there's a tower coming. Somebody know that. Yep, there's gonna there's talk. There's an argument here. Deadly words. Yep, my person and unfinished business. Look at this shit here. Mm, mm, mm. 
You see that? Yeah. I feel like your ex, to be honest with you, with dreams in a moon card. Yeah, this is someone that's going to have this from you and act like cold as ice, like ain't nothing going on, ain't nothing wrong. But you can tell by their attitude, it's this person's ex. Oh my gosh. It's salty about a new relationship. <laughs> and this is someone that can't like astro travel to you no more. It's like you're not connecting or you're not responding. What is the love or cool message? We're going to grab some letters for you guys too. Mm. What's the love or cool message here? Just for the collective, what's the love or cool message? Solitude, yeah. Talking, seeking help. Oh, this is also someone here that feels like you guys have unfinished business and they're calling you their person when they're talking to other people. They could be saying they're trying to get like people's advice on what should they do because you're like moving on. Yep, secret help. <laughs> No, that ain't funny. Maybe a little bit. But that's what's happening. Yep, because you're their Juliet. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Vows of love. Here they ass come. <laughs> I love you. I love you. You want to leave me? You want to leave me? Yeah. The fuck you think this is? Um, Archangel Zykel. Yeah, because they keep doing the same fucking rituals or something. Archangel Zykel rules magic. People think that magic started from the dark to the and it started from white occult. White magic, that's right. The devil was an angel first, baby, and he traded his soul. Don't forget, he went against God. Okay? He learned all his magic from... He was an angel before. Never forget that. Yep, hermaphrodite. Yeah, some of you guys are going to get scared with this person. Yep, see? It's specific. This is a spiritual marriage union come together. Let's see what this person wants to say to you. Have my kid. This person wants you. Yeah. Oh! Attached to my ex. I can't. That's crazy. And this is a little energy that was like rubbing off in the other reading too. There's an ex that... There's some exes that is going to be lingering around spiritual connections. These are karmics. Yep, it's really simple. How do I feel? I want you. I want forever. And they know somebody is going to want you. And want y'all going to like be happy together. This could be like blending kids together. You know, they could still want a baby. Yep, I'm sorry. It's here. The future. Yeah. You're so special. I feel like it's both of y'all's exes. I'm just getting that. I've been getting that all day. Yep, you're so smart. Gaslighting you. Yep, for the wounds and gaslighting you. Now, if this is somebody that guessed lit you before, they could want a new cycle coming in or ghosted you before because I'm also getting that. And they're coming in brand new and a brand new energy. Others of you guys, this is a new person. This is also something um, that is attached to this new person and what they're going through with an ex. That could have ghosted them. So take it how it resonates, yeah, and gaslit them. Yep. Now, both of you guys could be experiencing this because of both of the energy that both of you guys are in. And I told you, dreams. Yes. They are coming in your dreams, astro, connecting, um, coming to you at night, feeling the energy, trying to feel you, see what's up with you. See if they can feel somebody else there. They are in like three months. Maybe even three weeks, yeah. Let's get an oracle. Let's get an oracle message. Oh, my gosh. Because mm, this is, yeah, honey. Somebody here is about to be so, whoa. Okay. All right, what's the oracle message here? Show me um, the oracles. What's the oracle message? Oh, two. We have investigate. I told you that's how they investigate you. 
Mm. That is how they investigate you by filling your energy. This is a true hermit or hermitess. This person is fucking. They could have like strong Virgo or certain earth placements. I heard cuss signs, so there could have a cuss sign somewhere. What is this? Yep, follow your own good advice. And for some of you guys, they feel like you are not like honoring something or you're not. Um, following something that you should be doing as well. Yeah, painting the roses red. Covering up eras. Yep, and that's what they're doing. Now they're trying to cover up eras of why they could have ghosted you, why it went wrong, and it's all because they they know what's happening. They know about a new person. They know you're getting this new person. For some of you guys, they are filling this out spiritually, literally. You're doing this shit. Um, yep, and they're all mad. We're all mad here. I told you. These are exes for both of you guys. It could be on different levels for each of you, but all together, collectively, this is the energy. Mm. Well, you snooze, you lose. Shit. What is that? Yeah, these are karmics. The self note, yep, mm-hmm. And for some of you guys, someone here could have, like, family with a karmic, too. Someone here could also have, like, a teenager with a karmic. They have teenage children together. Yeah. Someone here can have, like, a Tesaurus or Capricorn placement. Didn't I say that? Earth placement specific or cusp. What is going on? Cuff signs or fixed signs. These are also signs that are set in their ways. This person is set in their ways. So... Maybe they got, like, certain ways. And now that you are moving on, it's bothering them. Oh, well. Shit. I mean, I don't know. Like, what are you supposed to do? Uh, yep, tension. They pissed, honey. They mad at the motherfucker. Um, yep, future. Oh, because your future doesn't include them. Yeah, journey. Oh, I mean... Y'all, I know. I'm an empath. I, I shouldn't be feeling bad. But could they really feel... Yup. Yeah, th this is going to hit Metro Retrograde. One of the retrogrades. I really feel bad because I feel like... You know how some people is like stuck in their own way. And it's like they can't help themselves. Because they're, they're so, this person is very stuck in their ways. Yeah, they are. And they're getting clarity on that. Yep. Yeah, somebody here got strong to source placements. Yep. Yeah, relationship. Seventh house. They have to heal something in the way they deal with relationships. They have gotten clarity on that on the uni in, in, in the universe. This is also a karmic energy that is in your seventh house. But this is why. Um, yeah. Shit. Five, four, three, four is an angel number here. You could be also in between the ages of 34 and 54. Some of you guys, you could have knew this person um, here, an ex that was 15 and 56, or this person, take it out, resonates. <clears throat> all right, guys, we're going to shut it down right there. I hope this helps you out in more ways than one. I love you all. Stay dope. Hit that bell. Hit all that keeps you tapped in and tuned in to your messages. All right, and I will catch you the next time you stop by in your next video upload, baby. I'll show you in a month.